guys, what's up? My name is Bazana Plays and welcome to the video. So guys, in today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to make free custom intros. So in this tutorial, we are going to be using a website called Panzoid. Now you don't need to download anything, so all you pretty much need to do is just find the template you like, then you can put your name on it, customize it, and download it. So yeah, um, I hope you guys did enjoy yesterday's video and yesterday, yesterday's story, vi story time video. I'm going to have another story time video coming out to, to later today. And yeah, with all that said and done, guys, let's get today's video started. Hey guys, what's up? It's Bogata here, and I have something to add about today's video. So if you guys are looking for gaming equipment, Cinch Gaming has it. Ranging from modified controllers to apparel, they have it all. And now with the custom Xbox One PS4 controllers, go head over to cinchgaming.com or the link in the description, and don't forget to use the code Bogata for an extra discount. Alright guys, so the first step you want to do is actually head over to panzoid.com. should be on screen right now and linked in the description so it's easier for you guys to find it. So once you get here, there's a couple different options. You can go to the community templates where you can find um, custom ones that um, other people on Panzoid have made, or you can use the standard ones Panzoid has. I recommend using uh, community templates, and I'm just going to go on to that. But you can also go on to the other. So guys, there is a lot of to choose from. I will tell you guys that. So, um, I'm just going to find one I like. I really like this red one right here, so I think I'm going to go with this one. But you guys can pick any one that suits you. So, once you click on it, all you got to do is open it in Clip Maker. I guess so it may take a couple of moments to actually get it to open up in Clip, Ma Clip Maker, but that's pretty much, that's fine. So, guys, I'm going to put on my headphones, and yeah, you guys are going to be able to hear this too. So, I'm going to play this intro to see if I like it or not. Alright guys, so I think this is a really cool intro actually. So the first thing I'm going to do is go over this box right here. <clears throat> so this is where I'm going to be changing most of the stuff guys. So if you're using this one, the name is actually the bottom one and the yours the top one. So sometimes it does get a little confusing. So I'm going to change the your, so I'm going to change this to Bogata. And caps lock is on, my bad guys. So that one's going to say Bogata, then this one is going to say Plays. So sometimes you have to actually click off of it real quick, and then um, then you can hop off of it. You can't just type it in, go to a new one. So it's going to be Bogata. Click right here. Alright, and there it goes. So as you see, it has this. So I'm going to finish the rest of it. So I'm going to add for the background of it, I'm going to change these two. So the your is going to be Bogata, and the name is going to be Plays. So guys, you can change a lot of these things. I like to keep them how they are. They look best um, like how they are. Sometimes I do some minor changes, but I don't really do that much to it. So click over here. All right, so now guys, what I'm going to do is I'm going to put my headphones back on, and now we're going to watch this with my name in it. So I think this is a really nice intro. So guys, once you're finally totally done customizing it, you want to go down to this thing with an arrow and a line. So you can change all this stuff, guys. And make sure you have... I just like to keep the mode. Um, I like to have a faster render time, so I'm going to do that. Um, buffer size is up to you, and encoding threads is up to you. So I'm just going to start the video rendering. So I'm going to render that out, and I'm going to be back, guys, when this is done rendering. Alright guys, so once your thing has downloaded your render, now you're just going to click download your video. So this should only take a few seconds since it's already actually rendered in another thing. So, I'm just going to wait for this and I'll be right back when this is done and then I'm going to show you guys the final project. Alright guys, so it just did download so all I'm going to do is go, I don't know why that popped up. So I'm just going to go open my files guys and go to my downloads folder. So, yeah, I hope you guys did find some really cool intros. They do have some really cool ones in the community things. So, yeah, let's just go to Downloads. And... Clip Maker. It should be under Clip Maker, if you guys were wondering. Alright, guys, I did get it to work this time. Just waiting for it to load up. And here we go. Very nice. I like it. I think it's a really cool intro and everything, so I'm going to replay it one more time for you guys to see. 
And yeah. Yeah, this is a really nice intro. Alright guys, that's pretty much it for today's video. If you guys enjoy how to make custom intros with Panzoid, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video.